Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Joel and today I'll be showing you the fastest way to edit your raw time-lapse stills into a video. We're going to assume that you've already shot a time-lapse with three to five hundred raw photos and you'd like to turn it into a video. To start we're going to make sure we have one folder with all of our stills and nothing else inside of it. We're going to open up Adobe DNG Converter. We're going to select our folder. We're going to save the new DNGs to a folder inside that folder called DNGs and press convert. This usually takes just a few minutes. In the meantime, we're going to open up DaVinci Resolve and create a new project. We're going to start in the media pool, find our sunset time lapse, and drag our DNGs into the media pool. Then we're going to right click and create a new timeline using the selected clips. Then we're going to head on over to the edit module, reframe our clip as needed, and you can scrub through it right away. And this is an 8K raw time lapse, no problem. Now would also be a good time to stabilize and recrop anything that needs to be changed. Next, we're gonna head over to the color module. We're gonna decode using clip, which gives us access to the raw photo settings, including white balance. I'm gonna grade for the middle. Then we can add as many nodes for color correction as we'd like. DaVinci Resolve has great motion blur, de-flicker, and denoising. However, with the free version, you can't use it. So I'm hoping to upgrade once Studio 17 is available, but for now, we're not able to use de-flickering. Using keyframes and nodes, you're able to create transitions from the start to end of your clip for smooth sunset shots. Once you're happy with your clip, we're gonna head on over to Deliver. Select H.264 Master, give it a name, and add it to the render queue. Then we simply press Start Render. So in about five minutes, we're able to go from uh, unedited RAW files to a beautiful H.264 clip with a free software that actually utilizes the GPU. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, please do, it really helps, and I look forward to seeing you guys again soon.